Friends, the customer has complained that the water is not heating enough. The causes could be in the thermostat. Thermostat unit itself may be faulty. Or the thermostat setting is incorrect. Let us check the thermostat unit. For this, we need to open the geyser unit which we have already seen. Step 1. Open the geyser unit. Step 2. Locate the thermostat in the geyser. Step 3. Using a screwdriver, unscrew the screws on the thermostat. Step 4. Carefully remove the wire connections on the thermostat. Step 5. Remove the thermostat unit. Step 6. Check the thermostat setting using a test lamp connected in series. Take the test lamp and connect it in series with the thermostat. Touch the face terminal of the test lamp on the face terminal of the thermostat. Connect the neutral end of the test lamp to the neutral terminal of the thermostat. Here, the test lamp glows. This means that the thermostat setting are correct. In case the lamp does not glow, calibrate the thermostat. Move the thermostat switch until the test lamp glows. When the lamp glows, it means that the thermostat switch is set at the right setting. In case the lamp does not glow, the thermostat is faulty. And we need to check the thermostat settings and replace the thermostat unit. Okay, now let us see the procedure to check if the thermostat unit is defective using a multimeter. Step 7. Using a multimeter, check the thermostat. Set the multimeter dial to resistance. Place the red positive probe of the multimeter on the positive terminal of thermostat. And place the black negative probe of the multimeter on the negative terminal of thermostat. Check the multimeter readings. If the multimeter shows a reading, then the thermostat is OK. If the reading is zero or infinite, then the thermostat is defective. In that case, replace the thermostat. And that's not all. We also need to check the thermostat rod for its setting. Let us see the procedure. Step 8. Test the thermostat in series with the test lamp. Connect the test lamp in series with the thermostat. Connect the face terminal of the test lamp with the face terminal of the thermostat. Connect the neutral end of the test lamp with the neutral terminal of the thermostat. Step 9. Light the candle and place the thermostat rod over the candle flame. Allow the rod to heat up and reach the set temperature setting of the thermostat. When the temperature rises, the test lamp glows. And when the test lamp stops glowing, it means the thermostat rod has reached the temperature setting. So the thermostat rod is OK.
the geyser cutoff switch does not cut the supply according to the thermostat settings, the lamp keeps glowing. This means the thermostat rod is defective. In that case, replace the thermostat. And friends, now you know that this was the reason for water not heating. Remember the customer complaint? So the geyser thermostat Raju is checking is faulty. He will replace it with a new thermostat. And here is the chart that sums up the thermostat checking procedure. Take a look at it.